Hello. Hey, Grubs. Uh, I think this is live. Sorry, I had a little issue. Hey, welcome. Welcome to the MS Paint Monday. How is everybody? Hi, Tostella. Also saw Leo a little bit early. How is everybody doing? Uh, did something happen? Jadex? Hi. I had to change. I have two networks and I had to change to my to the network that I stream on. So I was wondering if um, maybe there was a little hiccup. Hopefully not. Hey, Limon. New profile pic, right? I had to reload the stream because the stream wouldn't start. Really? That's pretty weird. Hopefully um, that's not going to be like an issue for everybody. Oh, really? Same here. Ah. Uh, it might be my fault. Like I said, I, I changed networks at the very beginning because the other one I use for like daily use, but it's not as good as this one that I use uh, specifically for streaming. But yeah, how is everybody doing? Happy Monday. Ooh, um, little update from me. I, I, I had a like a really really fun idea. So this is like just me in my real life. So the other day, um, I've been wanting to have a. Just I met a PNG tuber a couple of months ago. Oh really? That's pretty cool. Um. The other day, I've been wanting to get um. Uh. Carnivorous plant. So I got a pitcher plant, the Nepenthes. Uh It's one that, that looks like this, right? Like they had the little, like little jars, I guess. Like a uh, big bill, you know? So I got one of those. And then I started looking uh, at, you know, the usual, the the care, the needs, whatever you need to do to take care of them. I'm pretty nervous. Like, I hope that I won't do badly with that. I feel like it's... I feel like it's gonna be in danger, but hopefully it will be okay. Um, I hope that I can take care of it. But yeah, I've been seeing people doing, like, little terrariums. Like, um... You know, the little things, they do like a glass, I guess, like a glass cube. And then they do several layers and things, and then they put the plants in there, right? So I thought maybe I could do that a little bit more DIY. And I thought, hey, I, I love this little aesthetic. Uh, hey, DG, I'm a bit tired, so I don't know how long I'll be here. Don't worry. Uh, at least I'm glad to see you here. Hi. I know it's a little bit late. Uh, I was running up and down uh, all over town trying to get like a little... How about you, Terrarium? What's that? It's like a type of plant or something? But it does sound fun. I, I, I love how those look. Uh, wait, 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 I can't imagine my disappointment when this YouTuber I like talk about carnivorous plants and he says they're not as cool as in the movies. Ooh, I, I actually do love carnivorous plants so much. Uh, they're my favorite. So, uh, instead of getting the typical, how would you call it, like, glass cube or, or whatever, I thought I'd get one of those, like, pet how would you call it? Um, I don't know. Those typical uh, simple ones um, that are meant for fish or, I don't know, little reptiles or insects when you get them at first. 
So I thought, hey, this would look like really cool if I um did this. So yeah, it's looking a little bit like this right now. So it's like I still um I didn't repot it because I feel like I'm probably gonna kill it if I do it right now. Um but yeah, it's like over there like this, you know. And we have a few little layers of um and then it can be there pretty humid um because when i spray it now um all the water is going to stay in that environment so i feel like that is a lot better for the for the plant but yeah that's a little update um of me today I'm addicted to something new. What's that? Today I went to university. Have a very important English exam. Um, hopefully it went pretty good. Wait, but some technical issues happened. So like the thirty-three of the people who went twenty-five have to go tomorrow. Oh, well, at least you could say it's extra time to study, right? What if I take a bite of the plant though? No! Homer Simpson AI covers of Hispanic songs? That is so specific, but at the same time, that sounds pretty funny. And is it like the um, Spanish voice of Homer Simpson or, or uh, the English one kind of singing? Because I, I've heard a few. Um, Jojo AI covers where they sing like they have a little bit of their accent still going on but I don't know it's the same character for you yep I'll drink a little bit of water I also sent the terrarium. What are those? Oh, cool. Let me, let me go grab it. Let's see that. Um, did you do Gmail or um? Wait, what? My Gmail died. Wait, what? Uh, for some reason, my Gmail died. Huh. And as long as you enjoy it. I didn't like Miku music. Um but I get it. I don't know why Gmail is dead for me right now. I'll wait a few minutes maybe. It's pretty weird. Ah, a little bit stretchy. I hit the centralistic system. Okay, so, um, speaking of where we left, one of the ones that we had to do today was meant to be Miku. Still, I'm hoping that maybe we get a another idea, and you grubs can save me from drawing Miku. Feel like that's gonna be complicated, but if we don't have any other idea for Cyan, we get a Miku, right? Um, but as of now, I think we're doing. Uh, it was a welcome home character. Which one was it? It has like four arms, I think. Um, I don't remember the name, but I actually do need to know the name to search. Um. What is it? Ah, give me a second. Yeah, we do. Howdy. I see. Sounds like uh, you're greeting me. Oh, is it a caterpillar? I thought it felt buggy, right? But I didn't know it actually was a caterpillar. <laughs> the stream delay is real. Oh. 
Damn, I'm so sorry. It it really must have been my fault about um. When I did that change. Um, must have messed things up. Hopefully it's not too bad. It's just Jadix. I don't know, my... I still can't enter Gmail, so... I feel like something must be going on on my end, too. But we'll draw a little, and then, um... After finishing Howdy, we'll get, we'll see the Terrarium, hopefully. If not, I'll try to enter on another browser. Okay, so Howdy, Howdy, Howdy. Which as best it is would never. But it would serve like thirty ads. <laughs> I mean that's not bad, but I'm just I'm just laughing about it. Okay. So I wonder what pose I could do for this. It's not on the mail site. You mean it said on Tumblr? I don't see anything. Oh, it was on Tumblr. Oh, I I get now what you mean. I get it now. Oh, can I show it? Would be better if I show it now because um, stays one of those days that I don't want to interrupt the. Yep, yep. It's a good pizza. I want pizza. I've been, I've been wanting a a deep dish uh pizza for a while, but I'll have to wait. So now I get what you mean by the you you who, um, it's pretty cool. There's a few plants in there, like uh, moss, I guess. Now I get what you mean with this. I was like, you mean you are like, is it like a terrarium of the chocolate or something like that? But no, it was, you just meant the recipient, the play pizza tower. I should, I should actually. There, I used my one pizza tower for the stream in the future. But the... That's a pretty cool terrarium, uh, Leo. I got tell y'all can see my nails. Oh my god. Sorry if I showed them. Uh, it's a cool color. It's like a very pearlescent, gloss pearlescent or something between reddish and yellowish and. Even some greenish tones. I like it. I personally don't like using um, nail polish, but um, I think I said it before, not long ago, I, I discovered a way that I could use them in a way that I would um, like it. It's a very peculiar style, but I'll maybe share it in the future, not right now. Thank you, I trusted my terrarium. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It feels like really um feels like a really fun and uh thing to have. Do you does it have like any special needs? Like do you do you do anything with it or do you just let it still let it sit still? And, you know, it, because I feel like some terrariums feel more like you leave it there, you do nothing, and then, uh, you know, it's takes care of itself. And I don't know what's the usual thing. I'm very new to this.
to be honest, I just do a dry nail polish. Nail. <laughs> uh, very in character, I, uh, I think. So let's do the little sketch with this color. Let's have this over here. Hopefully not taking too much space. Just as a reference to see what we're doing. I just put water in it and then it, when I need to. And how often do you need to water it? I use plants from my backyard because I didn't have anything else. So I think that's still pretty fun. I like that. Hey, bloody dude. You're drawing? So you wouldn't be talking much? What are you drawing? Let us know that at least. Yeah, I don't, I would never eat um, nail polish. I actually hate the smell, even though I don't have a good sense of smell at all. But that's one of those smells that I, I really don't like. Okay, um, I wonder what pose we could do for this. I don't exactly count, but I just look at it, and if there's no condensation inside, I put water in it. I suggest a spray bottle. So if I, I, so if I look at it and it feels dry, if it looks dry, I should water it then, right? A ref sheet of my D1OC, Chase. Trying to get ready for our fight. Yeah, it's getting pretty close and <laughs> I feel like I'm I'm not gonna be able to participate again this year, but who knows? My nail polish for some reason smells good. Does it smell different than others or did you just like the smell? Alright, let's see. Let's see what we can do with this. Um, is there something fun that we could get going with this one? I don't want to do the legs right now. Let's do let's do the face maybe. I ate my nails since I was a kid. My grandma got mad at me uh, for that, so she used to put a nail polish. I've heard about those, but my polish anyway, no, it, you were like, oh yeah, this nail polish so that I don't eat my nails. Mm, this is just uh, seasoning, a little bit of flavor for, for my nails. Yeah, from what I read, but suggested every two weeks to rewater it. Uh... And sometimes I need to open it to clean because my cat knocks it over. Oh no. I wonder, should I? Let me take a good look. I need to understand what to do with so many arms and legs. <laughs> right? So something like I'm moving my hands around to to think of what I'm doing, right? So something like this. You can't see this, but my hands are up in the air. Like, wah. So something like Like this. Wait. No, so what? Ah. Okay. I was just about to do the hands flipped around. 
that's not what I should be doing. So something like this. Wait, no, not even that. With all those limbs, a better hug from him goes crazy. <laughs> True. No, I have no nails and my fingers are all fucked up. But I have weird, weird girl swag. That's always the best, right? Uh, I would be pretty, pretty short in comparison, probably. Just a little bug. You grew an inch, really? That's uh, pretty impressive. Congrats, I guess. <laughs> Growth sport moment. Yeah. Okay, so let me... I feel like we need a little bit more of a bird's eye view. Right, so we're doing the hand. That might be a thing. Sometimes uh, you get height miscalculations. Today I found out the bus driver's husband is cheating on him with another bus driver. What the... F yeah, how did you find out? How did that even come up? So, yeah, a little apple. Um, is it? I don't think this is dark enough. I feel like it's barely showing up. So, I'll ch change the color so that we can actually look at it. Um, I think this looks a little bit better. It's almost black, but I don't know. I felt like that. Or no, let's do it greener, but darker, yeah. This still feels... The thing is... I feel like, like it's not showing up too well. That's my only issue. Maybe if I... If I do it... With a little, with a little bit more of um, a, of a, more line weight. Yeah, I think this might be okay, I guess. Let's kind of redraw this a little bit so that we can see it. Doing... Chunkier fingers. That's also good. For a puppet-like character. Oh, I like that. There's like a little um, pointy here. Thingy. It looks good. Alright. We're back at it again. Uh, we got some tall people in chat. Oh, really? Which means I, I can legally beat you up. Does that mean that you can? So I was getting out of the bus and I saw this thing rogue on the back of the seat. <laughs> I get it now. I don't want to fight. What about a dance fight? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dance off. Yeah, yeah.
Am I? I'm trying to see the hands. So many hands. Am I doing it correctly? Capoeira moment. A little bit like a Yakuza moment. Where they do those type of fighting too. Ah. Wait. Whoa. Uh, for some reason, the hotkey that I have is not working. What? Okay, let me see if it works now. It's working now. That was pretty weird. Sorry about that. I can't dance to save my life, but I like it. I love dancing, and I think I'm good at it, hopefully. So it's like... Behind and it's like something like this. I must paint anomalies. <laughs> I can only do a jig, that's all. Can't do good dance moves, so I dance like a clown. Hey, I mean, I love clowns, so that sounds like a good thing to me, right? I'm glad none of us can dance. Well, wait till you see me dance. Woo, woo, woo. Oh, I think I know what I want to do with this, but I'll need to edit this. So I want to do it like... Uh... This is also pretty weird because... Am I doing this? In a way, this character is a lefty, right? So I'm trying to do this right, hopefully. But it feels... It feels like I'm getting something wrong while I'm doing it. I love clowns too, seems amazing. I'm the streamer's favorite, I get privileges. <laughs> yeah, I love clowns. I, I think clowns should be like the next trend, right? We need a moment where people like get dressed up as clowns just as an aesthetic or something it has never fully happened that way like there have been a few blips of that here and there but I feel like we need a, a full clown um, thing going on at some point ah oh, this hand is giving me pain Oh, I think I may know how to fix it so that it doesn't look as weird to me. I think this is it. No, that's still... Oh, maybe like this? Uh, a little bit, a little bit. I wish I could dress up as a clown. I did once for Halloween. And not like a mean clown, just like a funny clown. 
Wait, what happened? She says that we can go to the toilet in class. Does she want to have... Yeah, some teachers are pretty intense about going to the restroom. I don't know why. I feel like it's... Yeah, it's that fear about um students just going there and wasting time. But at the same time, it's like... Um, you probably know which students will go there and waste time, right? Not like, yeah, you were in the secret Spanish stream. I wish I could, uh, but consider I am poor. Well, I didn't like do fully, fully clown either. I, I, I just grabbed a few clothes that I had and I think clown makeup is pretty cheap so yeah I didn't even do like a wig so so let's do something like something like this When I get too tired of class, I just get to the bathroom and hang out there for a while. That's what I meant when I said, uh, uh, teachers, uh, fear that. Don't flip your canvas. You know what? That actually might help. So I will. Good reminder. Give me. I, I often don't do it as, as much as I should, right? Just being lazy, but I don't know what happens. So we're doing like a pretty upwards looking image. It should be like, like a little bit like this. We're going to make it a, a little bit taller. Don't, don't worry about that. But let's flip. Let's flip. Oh, let's flip this. For a second, so that we can. Ah, let's also. No! Let's do transparency and let's flip it for a second so that we don't regret it down the line. Alright. I'm seeing this. It's not too bad, the hand now. But maybe I can, f um, change this up a little bit. Let's grab this so that we can give more space to the other little thingy. And we can also push this a little bit upwards like that. Looks a little bit better. Now for this one. Oh, that's that one is gonna be a hard one. Um. All right, so let's push this a little bit upwards. Kluger, clown sugar. I see. I was reading it as a clown cougar or something. And I was like, what? <laughs> Clown sugar daddy. Claddy. Don't let the asymmetry take him. <laughs> uh, I mean, I don't dislike asymmetry. Um, sometimes it can be a little bit... Um, but... But yeah. Whoa, I didn't know I could do this. So I can turn up my dial like this. And what? I didn't know I was able to do this. 
Clary. You have something you want to share? Why? <laughs> um. What did I miss? The Kluger. The Clown Cougar. Oh, is it that? I don't know. You girls were talking about a Kluger, so I wasn't sure what. Let's do, you know what, it honestly, could this kind of sus, what's well, Cougar your first thought? Honestly, I'm not sure. It, it, it read like it. Okay, if you, let's say, um, it says Kluger, right? Cut. It says Kluger. So if you remove the L, it almost reads as Cougar, right? It's not too far away from that. So yeah, kind of sus. But honestly, oh, no. You know what? The problem is that it almost feels like uh, the hand is like this, but this should be like the thumb, and then this should be like the fingers. Very discreet topic change. No, no, no. Oh, uh, I just uh noticed there a thing. <laughs> uh, what does cougar mean? Isn't it like the animal? Yes, that's what I was talking about. <laughs> uh. I used to thought of a clown cougar. Uh, that's a good one. Of course. No, we're not making fun of you. Um, there's a good uh explanation of that. Yeah, sweet summer child. So true. Ignorance is bliss. I'd rather they 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 think I thought about uh, the animal, right? That's all that I did, right? Honestly. Okay, I think we kind of fixed this. Looks good. Not too bad. Although, what, what, what? If you say, oh, no, I just hope you didn't search for it. I'd rather tell you myself than. Than let you search something like that. I don't know who that is, but the fact that it's called like Tigress feels fitting enough. <laughs> I feel like that probably kind of fits the role. Welcome to my experience.
goes a little bit like that sometimes, so yeah. Um, but yeah. You know, one time I was actually thinking about, like, is there a place where I can actually become a clown? It's one of those things that sometimes makes me wonder. I'm like, I want to be a clown. Is there a way that I can sign up to be a clown in some way? But then again, maybe I don't have the actual time and experience to to be a full-time clown. It's like sometimes too, I want to be on, on plays or on musicals. I wish there was something um, fun around where I live. But also, I never know what is going on in the outside world. So, like, I have no idea of... I would have no idea if there's anything like that going on in my city. Oh, I see people still kicking on their juggalos. Yeah, it's um, a little bit... Parallel, I still love it because of Gamsey, but otherwise, um, feel like it didn't hit me enough in my aesthetic. I feel like mine is a lot more colorful and funny, in a way. Have you heard of the guy who was attracted to clowns on that way? What do you mean? I mean, for a little while, everyone was attracted to clowns because of that Phoenix Wright clown girl, which I do find attractive, if I do say so myself. It was because of Homestuck, but I like their music. I like uh, to catch a predator. I I feel like I've heard a few songs recently. I heard one of their ICP songs, one of the ICP songs, and I think ah uh, I don't know what it was called, but it was pretty fun. Hocus Pocus, I think that one was pretty fun. I heard it recently. Oh, yeah, I did. I did see that guy who was attracted to balloons. That to me felt like too much. <laughs> uh, I don't know how you can feel it. I guess the texture. But. Uh, I don't know. It was a little bit. Impressive to me. Yeah, I was attracted to clowns before that too. Yeah, me too. Although, that one is pretty attractive too, right? Oh! Uh, did you, did you girls ever hear about that case of a clown who died? Because, so there was a clown, I guess, and he had one of those long um, balloons, right? And then he tried swallowing it, the balloon or something like that. Like if it was a sword or something. And then I think in the middle of it, the balloon popped and it sticked to the sides of its throat. And then he asphyxiated, I guess. He died. What's going on with the little bands around Howdy's finger? Are they a foreshortening guide? Yeah, I was trying to see if it made sense, like... 
Um, so I was, it, it is basically that, a foreshortening guide, although I'm not doing any fancy effects when we color it, I just want it to make sense in my head, like, I try to see it as a 3D object, if that makes any sense. Gross that that wasn't funny. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess, I'm sorry. I want to go out in a funny and ironic way. I feel like I would actually go out in a... Okay, no, maybe not. In an ironic way. Um, I don't know why. I feel like I'm, I'm gonna... At one point, I feel like I'm gonna have... Like, no joke, I feel like I'm gonna have dementia. And I, I think, like, I'm gonna be thinking bugs are all around me or maybe is, is that schizophrenia or i'm not sure but i feel like i'm gonna there's gonna come a point where i'm gonna be like super paranoid thinking that bugs are crawling all over me 24 7 so but i don't know i don't know so one of those things that i love bugs but I feel like I'm probably going to go crazy thinking about them in the future. You never draw perspective, guys, so I was confused. Uh, you know, I used to do that all the time. And there was a point where I could kind of see those in my head, I guess. Um... Uh, but right now I was having a lot of trouble with making sense of the hands, so that's why I actually did it. I like to chew on uninflated balloons. I guess they're rubbery. Uh I just realized something dumb. Dumb as in I said something dumb. Oh uh, what do you mean? Whatever do you mean? Guys, you want to know some gossip about my life? Um, sure, if you want to share. Bugs crawling in my skin. It's more likely than you think. Yeah, I, I, I know that because I had it happen to me. Uh, one time I was feverish. I uh, I felt like bugs were crawling over me, and I I was getting like pretty anxious and all that. I felt like I couldn't sleep at all because every time I would feel like my skin crawl or something. And I've read about it, and it does happen. There's like an there's actually like a name for it and all. So that's why I feel like oop. I'm gonna get that. So earlier, I got this gum that whitens the teeth, and I tried and exclaimed how it was bubblegum flavored. Of course, it's bubblegum flavored. It's gum. I guess I meant more like the toothpaste gum. Well, but there is a bubblegum flavor, right? And bubblegum can actually have different flavors that are not bubblegum flavored but I don't know how to explain it so I get where you're coming from but at the same time I understand because yeah I mean it could be like banana flavor and you could say well it is a bubblegum with uh <laughs> yo yo he took a bite of gum gum Really good uh, reference over there. Uh, so there's this random dude on Twitter that thinks we're like boyfriend and girlfriend, but we literally talk for a week. Uh, that's pretty intense. And I don't know how you would assume that 
just just because like wouldn't you ask I mean as long as you you can make yourself clear and they respect that is that a one piece reference yeah of uh, the uh, one piece rap I may have parasocial relationship, but at least I'm not unironic about them. <laughs> he told me he wants to start a family with me. Maybe it's time for the um moving a little bit faster, buddy. But I mean, some people uh, get excited like that. It's not the worst thing, but... As long as they don't push for things like that, making you uncomfortable, it's not the worst. But if you ever feel uncomfortable, then you should say so. Because many times people like that don't get hints, you know? Man, it was like, I will give you a kid and raise it with you. Yeah, if you're like, if it really, really bothers you, then a block is totally, um, totally okay. No need to, to say anything. If you want to be friends, then you could, like I said, actually clear things up. But sometimes people, yeah, can't think things too far, so, um... You should, like I said, it's about reading the situation, I guess. Uh, some people do not stop and bother, like, too much. Hopefully, I hope this one isn't bad, but yeah. A little bit too intense for, for my taste. Fixing this a little bit. You already planned the whole date where we went to Paris. Then we had a picnic. Then he takes me to a museum. That almost sounds like role play. Not even like actual planning. <laughs> but like I said, you should um read the situation and, and see... And see what to do with it. So you should be clear with what you feel like. Some people can't take a hit, you know? And let's do other. Oh, we went. actually wanted this one to be like this I feel like I have no no scars myself I do have one in in my eye I had like a little one time my I'm trying to draw a damn circle. One time, my brother too threw sand at me. And then it got stuck in my eye. And then it started... Like, a little thing started growing on my eye. So they had re to remove that. So I have like a little line like this in my eye. Scarring you are your eye. That's hardcore. I mean, it's a little bit more dumb than 
what it sounds like, but yeah. Relation of talking, he asks, What's our relationship? Are we dating? Are you okay with me saying? <laughs> Do you? I don't know that. I would read that as maybe you're too eager to enter a relationship. Maybe it's not about me, it's more about you just want to have someone like that. But like I said, yeah, you should understand where you're at. And and know where how that is. Makes me think of how people think David Bowie had a heterochromia. Because one of his people was permanently dilated. Oh yeah, that's right. Can I hope we can still match though? Oh the scar. How the scar anime character have in their noses, making them seem edgy but mine smaller. Hey, Herrick. How are you doing? Welcome to the stream. Uh, which anime scar? The one that I like is where the nose is like, like this. And the scar is like, like this. I like drawing that one, I guess. Like a side one, I guess. It's me, stick, but oh, I see. The, I I didn't recognize that name. That's why. <laughs> Welcome. I now remember. <laughs> How are you doing? We're continuing with the color wheel. I'm doing the Welcome Home Howdy character. That one? Let's go. <laughs> that one's pretty cool. But I can imagine it, it. It is smaller, but it's still pretty cool. Do you remember how you got that one? But small on the bridge. I see. I see. Okay. Only okay. Cool. Mm, this feels. I should make it smaller. Should I? Nope. Not liking that. I think I'll know what to do. Yeah, it's a good a story to know how they were they were created. The scar creation. Yeah, I feel like I have other than that one, I don't think I have any intense scars. I've never broken a bone or anything either. It's too dumb, I got it because I was rubbing one side of the ruler on my nose so much. No, <laughs> Yeah, I understand now. I feel like I almost got one like that once. Um, I had this like body spray thing. And it was like winter, so it was pretty, pretty cold. And I tried to do something just to test how it would do. So I tried spraying with that super super cold spray on my hand like on one single point and it actually like um damaged my skin for a little bit uh but it didn't leave any like lasting scars or anything but it's one of those things that you do like out of boredom and just seeing what happens and i don't know that's why I could relate with that.
doing the paper bag and then I'll do the the other paper, right? Nelsers are fragile. It does depend on your skin, I guess. You ran out of... I actually don't recognize the fragile. Is it something? Like a game? Because I didn't get the reference. I wish Gnosis were stronger. Yeah, aren't they like cartilage? Something like that? So they are indeed not strong. And I hate how they do nose jobs. Where they actually have to break your nose, basically. I don't like that at all. I probably do have a... What is it called? Deviated septum? I can't breathe too well, but... I wouldn't do that. I'd rather... <laughs> I'd rather be a mild breather. Oh, uh, bye, Herrick. Thanks for thanks for stopping by. Have a good night and don't let the bed bugs bite. Hopefully, I'll see you next time. I hate nose jobs. I don't like them either, honestly. I I actually like natural nose noses. Um. Noses are actually like so full of how would you call it personality so I don't know oh, okay yeah to be a little bit faster but i'm scared about miku that's the one that scares me if you guys if any of you grubs have a cyan colored character you can save me from doing miku and taking so long i am the sniffer but most importantly i am the hearer i be hearing someone whisper my name <laughs> The Fragile is an award-winning double platinum uh, nine-inch nail double album released in 1999. Oh, I see. I see now. Rhinoplasty can be good in the context of repairing a nose that doesn't work properly. Oh, of course. I mean, I, I'm not saying that it's something that shouldn't exist when it's needed. And there's always uh, reconstructive surgery which would be to help people who have been on accidents and things like that i just don't like um uh when people you know dislike their noses and it's like no but your nose makes you right miwa from jitsu kaisen Although, I do still feel like Miku's a little bit more, um... I'm going to try to go to bed early because I got a tattoo appointment tomorrow. Wish I could stay later. Good night. Oh, I feel like I... Didn't get, uh, what are you tattooing to your skin, I guess, <laughs> uh, if you want to share. Uh, but yeah, have a good night. Ho hopefully the tattoo appointment goes pretty well. Good luck with that.
because I knew the reference sheet you were making, but not the other thing. I don't like my nose, but I would never change it because, well, because I'm poor, but so because I just have to live with what I got. Yeah. It's about loving yourself, right? Unfortunately, even the cosmetic side of that isn't simple either. People like trans people and BIPOC get discriminated against or ostracized for having atypical noses. And that's the reason why I feel like um, that too. Um, people should like all types of noses, right? Uh, we have like a, a social standard, which not only... Do I not really, really fully like? It's like um, too cliche. I I don't know. And it it just looks like uh. I feel like usually it just looks like a, a nose job nose, I guess, and I don't like that. Uh, but yeah, that too. I I. I do feel like there's so many types. Sizes and shapes of noses. A jellyfish. Ooh, that's nice. Is it? Oh, I'll let you go to bed. I'm just wondering if is it in color, I guess. But yeah, uh, have a good night. Don't let the bed bugs bite. See you next time. Right. Fixing the hands. Mm, no, this actually. I'll make it like this. Let's see if this works now. I realized I had a big nose when my friend drew a portrait of me when I showed him my face for the first time. I mean, I don't think a uh, uh, bigger nose is manly or feminine. I feel like I do like big noses, so but that's but that's me. It it all depends on your taste, but I feel like there are people who will appreciate um everything, right? So there's always someone who will see. It is a good thing. And you should too, if uh, even if you feel like it's true. It would be nice if attitudes change about noses and other facial features. But in the meantime, it's the reason why people consider cosmetic surgery. Yeah, I guess. I still don't like it. Wait, wait, wait. Big noses are... Uh... I like jellyfish. Jellyfish thing. I think all noses are beautiful and everyone should inspect their nose, but not me. The only reason I don't like my nose is because I know a lot of people want a bottom nose, but like, it's not all that. I feel like uh, you should like your own nose, but it's, uh... yeah, it's always things like that. Uh, sometimes... It's always about the grass is always greener on the other side. People will want what others have and others will want what others want, right? So it's always going to be something like that, which I don't think it's so good. Um, people should like what they have. It's just, it's just all about self-love. But I know it is a hard task. It is tough to ask. I like my nose or my horn, you may say. <laughs> mm. 
The association with that of that with masculine and feminine has always been down to me. Yeah. I feel like big noses can be feminine. It's just about um what is on a male and a female, right? So why does that matter? But yeah, I guess, I guess. Uh, actually, like I said, I, I honestly don't even like the um, society's standards. I feel like I, I like what I like, and that's it. And people should too. People should like what they have, and they shouldn't feel like... Um, Pressure to like what society pushes, I guess. But for some reason, there's always this push to having like a standard, whatever it may be. There's always like, oh, this is the new standard. This is the. So it's probably it's always to sell like a product um, or something like that. It is made. For that purpose, so that you you want to fit into the standard. Now you need to buy this. Now you need to buy this. But that's a dumb reason. Uh, I think that Leo's getting. Wait, wait, wait. I think what Leo's getting at is different. But noses are usually associated with which. When cross with being trans man, oh my god, too many. What? Oh, associated with family. So having a more angular problem knows what actually be a benefit. So, and having more of a button nose than my mom. So, yeah, I I think I honestly think um. Things like that shouldn't be. Like sometimes we're going for like the stereotypes. But there are actually more shapes than um, what we think about. Right. So. Uh, but yeah, it's a little bit um, hard to say. When I was a kid, my aunt always made fun of me, saying that I looked like a man. She really changed my brain chemicals for real, for real. But she makes some good strawberry pie, though. Uh, so she's good. I don't like strawberries, so that does nothing for me. No, but yeah, sometimes, you know, a lot of issues come from the family. Um, sometimes they really push... Uh, things onto us and when they push those kind of how would you call it I guess expectations I don't and you don't feel like you perform that's when a lot of things you know um make us could make us feel I mean it it that didn't happen to me, but I know people, so I understand, like. Well. Uh, I need to make this longer. A lot longer. Uh, actually, I don't get big this for you. So, that's good. I just don't want a bottom nose, because I know a lot of people want a bottom nose. I don't feel right to having one. You shouldn't feel like you don't deserve your nose. You, I honestly feel like you should like your nose because it is your nose. Not because other people want it. Not because uh, it's a cool nose to type to have or anything. Just because it is your nose. So you should love yourself and your nose. But I, I, I understand. Hey, Orion. Nice to catch a stream. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you're here. Welcome to the stream. I'm drawing a little bit slow. Um, but and that's an always thing, right? <laughs> that's the thing that always happens. But hey, 
We're doing what we can here. MFB, like, you're a beautiful girl. And then they look at me and say, you look just like your dad. Honestly? Um. Honestly, I, I think looking like your dad isn't really bad on on its own, right? I feel like I know girls who look like their dad. Like, I've seen their dad, and I see, like, oh, you do look like your dad. And I would say they're pretty good looking, right? So... Honestly, having the, I guess, the dad genes doesn't mean you look like a man, right? Isn't a kinesis for when you turn 13? That feels more like um, the bar mitzvah. Kinesis is pretty sure 15 in Spanish. Uh, there's stuff I could say about having something people want and not wanting it, feeling ungrateful, but is that oh I see I see. Yeah, I think um I think there's always that thing that hey maybe I have this, people want it, but why do I have it? Why do I deserve it? Or maybe I'm not as seeker as others since you see other people struggling or wanting that, you feel like, well, maybe it's uh, a little unfair. But I honestly, like I said, I think everyone should just love themselves and appreciate what they have. Not because others want it, but just because, you know, they're um, just because it's theirs, right? Just because it's yours, appreciate it. My sister got all the good genes from the man. <laughs> I got his unibrow. I've heard about the the fight in genes. Uh, I had a friend that would always tell me like, "Oh, it's so unfair. My my sister is so good looking," and and she was like, oh, "But I'm not." But I I don't think she was bad looking or anything but I, but I understand her sister was like more to social standards but like like we're saying like I keep saying um wait 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 wait, wait. no yeah Barbie's wife is for 13 uh I think the Kinsas for 13 is like making fun. Yeah. <laughs> if you're into pain, and there's always tweezers. Yeah, I've heard about people who who um go the tweezers route and it actually boosts their confidence. I don't think it's needed, but I guess if, if it's something that you want, you can do that. Wow, bully, bullying in chat. <laughs> so, uh, grubs or bullying other grubs, picking on the small grubs, right? It's just because they're short, right? Is that it? Is that the reason why? Huh? I don't know how the, well this section looks, but okay.
I think we're going for the doodle status, even though I feel like we left that place a long while ago, probably. But since it's that doodle status, status um, I guess this is good enough, right? We can start doing this. Okay, so let's go for that line art. 21. I waxed my unibrow because everyone made fun of me of that growing up. Yeah, probably um, as an adult, probably people don't care as much. Everyone is on their own um, business. And I can picture it looking, that being a look. I don't think it's... It's bad on its own. Although waxing is pretty hardcore. I don't think I've ever waxed anything. I feel like it would scare me. Like, does it hurt? I actually feel like tweezers would be a lot less hurt. Right? A lot less hurtful. Just my sculpture, but I don't feel like fixing it anymore. What were you sculpting? What was it? And can you fix it later? Oop. Uh, I like his face. He looks like a wet sock. That's very punchable and I mean that in the best way possible. I mean, I hope that's good, I guess. Tweezers hurt less, but are more time consuming. That sounds like that's true. A wax does sound like a one-time deal every once in a while. Based waxing. With wax you have to commit to a certain area and pace, but with tweezers it's just one at a time. Yeah, I guess there are pros and cons. Uh, epilators are right in the middle because they pretty much monorize tweezers. Mm. No, it's just a pair of random wire. That wasn't what I wanted to do. Well, then maybe it's fine. Maybe it's fine as a failed project for now. But I, I also don't want you to get a bad grade or something. So maybe fix it later. Or work with me. Work with me. Oh, by the way, um, a little random. But recently I've been like super, super motivated 
and inspired to do things that I was pretty much slacking on. Hopefully, I know this always, uh, this is, at this point, this is almost like my catchphrase, but hopefully in the future we get fun stuff for the channel. Had a few story ideas and things like that, that could be pretty good. Um, maybe that's like one of the things that I want to, um, start working on in a few like work streams, which would mean less chatting, but more working and more content then. But yeah, um, I'm super, super inspired and super having fun writing things that I want to do because that's always my um my advice whatever idea you have write it down because sometimes you do forget about things even if you think you don't you won't but you will lately I'm really failing at stuff but one day I would laugh about it not this year though um yeah, I don't think I I think it's a little bit better if you try your best. Sometimes it's or you know what? I don't know. I feel like there was a year where I was failing everything and I do laugh about it now because at that time, I was reading so much manga during classes and all. So, it was pretty bad, but it was my best reading year, I guess. So, at least that is funny. And I don't regret reading things, but I did... Um, I do feel like uh, I could have done things a little bit better. At least there have been times where I pick up the slack and all that. Wait, what? So we can say you're grabbing the shovel? Wait, what? Wait. This man has a thumb for a head. Uh... He does. Oh! Oh, I see now. This is the antenna, right? I thought it was the thing on the little hat. But now I get it. Now I see. It all makes sense now. So then I'm actually gonna make this one like this. So that we take a better look at it. And it looks more in display. I just figure it out. I got an F on all subjects, but Monster fucking slept so, so happy. How did you know? No, but that was me too, honestly. Um, that's either interspecies or um, Monster Musume. I feel like. <laughs> At least those were the ones that I, that I had my craze over for a while. You just said you read manga, so I na a name and a claim one. But I wonder which one, actually. Um... I just did a 
bad translation of an expression. Parar la pala. You're welcome. Now you know more Spanish. Thank you. I gotta be for bisexual because I finally figure out what I am. So if you get an A, you become asexual. If you get a. What else? I don't know what other. Do you become demisexual? What? I do read manga, but I never read one about monster fucking, so. Am I being confused? I, I just named two. So maybe you mean you missed that I met the manga monster. Is it about that? I haven't read monster so. But now you you've given me a reason too. I'm just kidding. I've heard about uh. Oh. Wait, what? I think we all read it. Yeah. I think we all read it as Monster Dead instead of Monster Slaps. Like. I think you now see our confusion. Uh, maybe. Um, I actually did read it as if. As if it was like a monster doing series. So I thought like, oh, maybe you mean like uh, inter interspecies reviewers and or Monster Musume. Which I've seen and, and read. But now I know what you mean. So it makes it funnier. That misconception. <laughs> This is proof that I swear too much. You know, it's also like uh, the placement, I guess. That monster is very much a different genre from those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've heard it's pretty good, so I do want to read it, so. But it's totally a different thing. Totally, totally. The internet is wild. It is. It is a crazy place out there. Hey, vampires, I'm not too opposed to. If they're not the kind that's super cold to the touch. I think from those, I would say werewolves would be the... Or actually, I do like mummies too. Your kiss, Edward, the glitter boy, not Edward. What about um, what's the Adam Sandler one? Oh, it's just Dracula, I guess, right? That's a hot one. I'm making a joke, by the way. This line art is killing me. Bleh, bleh, bleh. But yeah, I feel like I would be on team... Um, Werewolves, I guess. I like werewolves. But I do like mommies too. Uh, especially because 
my typical reference in Jet Set Radio and Radio. Was it Radio Future only? I don't. I think they're in the first one too, maybe. There's the Immortals, which have such style to them. Pretty good. I need the lead. Immortals. You want a vampire because they're hot? I want any kind of monster because I relate to the marginalized aspects of their personalities. I think for me it depends on the design and that's it. If I like the design it is then I like it and that's it. And if I don't then I don't. It's not too much about what thing it is. It is about design and personality honestly. It can make a big big input on me but vampires can climb on walls and things and have super wide variety of abilities well in terms of of their abilities yeah they're cooler i just like wolves aesthetically more so yeah so yeah if we were to say like if i were to pick what monster to be like a vampire or a werewolf a vampire is a lot more appealing right you're basically immortal and you just don't go out during the day which i almost don't <laughs> usually so a lot of perks just for basically for free while uh, a werewolf, it's more like a hassle, right? You you don't know when you're when you will turn, and that will be like a mess. You usually can't control it in stories, and maybe you can at some point, but it's like you probably need to learn. And at that point, you you might have killed. A few people, so yeah, not that good. Okay, yeah, emo werewolf suck heart goes hard though. Yeah, that is true. That is a perk that um, we do need to take into account. How hard you you will rock the look just sitting on the near a tree and thinking about life. It goes pretty hard. I search up the monster and I got hairy feet. Wait, what? You mean the manga? Oh no, wait, wait, what? The oak kind of rocks the vampire look. That's true. A very different vampire, but still. They do... They do rock the look. Do you want to know what El Pombrito does? I have no idea what that is, but I guess you can tell us.
I keep messing up the lines. He forces himself on ungrateful girls. What is going on? What? <laughs> what am I reading? No, any kind of woman, any time of the day. What, what, what? Let me do a quick Google search. What the? <laughs> what is? Why is folklore? Uh, why is folklore so hostile? <laughs> True. It didn't need to be as intense as it is, but it is. Just... I was I was just about to say that uh great catch then there's always Greek mythology where Zeus himself is the is that monster <laughs> so true No need to find any other creature but just just that Zeus himself. That's true. I guess um, there's always all this Japanese mythology about monsters like that. I didn't think about it too much, but I guess that's true. Are are those type of monsters what they used to do in the past like SCPs like they knew now with creepypastas and all that? Are those basically uh, are those two basically the same thing? But one is the old version now. We have this, where we talk about it on the... I guess the old ones, people sh would say they were real, I guess. And this is more fully literature. We have a guy that also person surprises me how much Japanese kids media features cap considering that's true. I mean, it is a cool design, honestly. But yeah. Can't type Kappa because YouTube puts in an emote Kappa. That's not Kappa for some reason. Interesting. Seems like it didn't. Or is it when it's capitalized? No. I don't see anything. Rare mobile user W. I guess. We have a folklore monster that is just a blonde green. <laughs> Why do you woman jump scare? That's true. That's the original white woman. Jump scare. Okay. 
Gringo means white guy, right? Or is it derogatory term? Um, it's probably at a midpoint, right? I feel like I've seen some people complaining about it. But as far as I know, it's just like a way to call like Americans. It's just a, that's not a kappa, that's an emoji. Is that what appears when you type that? Yeah, that's like the little moon sun emoji thingy. Gringo's not a slur, but with your help it can be. I don't know if that's good or bad. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not a slur, but I've seen people complain about that. The moon is a kappa, is it? Does it deserve, does it deserve the title of being a kappa? Or I guess the expression could be. Maybe is it because of that? I don't know. Maybe they felt like it was conveying the same feeling that the typical one does. It is a weird choice, though. Gotta drink some water. He almost made me laugh uh, with that, Janix. Just because something is in a slur doesn't mean I won't use it like one. No, you shouldn't. Um, I should go along with the joke. Uh, confusion be funny, serious. Which better keep my emoji? Hey, Kinotasha. Hello. Welcome to the stream. No, not welcome to that. That's not the impression that I want to give. I'm doing uh, the color wheel challenge, I guess. And drawing the green one, so we're doing howdy. Welcome. How are you doing today? Today is MS Paint Monday, as we usually have it, and we're not actually discussing slurs, or I guess, yeah, no, we're we're not, we're not. Um, just came up in a in an innocent way. It was just a genuine question, right? I do not endorse actual use of any slurs. Uh, a restaurant near me has a section on the menu 
call for the green ghost and i think it's basically the kids section you think so not too bad my day off so i'm relaxing oh yeah isn't today like uh festivity i guess i don't go out in the real world so i never know what's going on So yeah, I'm just trying to finish this line art so that we can go along. But no, it's about to be hour two. So I'm actually just going to be able to do two drawings today. That's going to be tough. I think, um, like I said, it would be good if we have a smaller cyan character. I guess Memorial Day. Yeah, that's true. But I didn't celebrate it. I guess you could say me neither because cause I'm here. But we're celebrating Emma Sprint Monday. That's right. I'm always celebrating that. Mara says, hurry up. Yep. Nah, shit. Always taking too long to do everything. But let's actually hurry it up this time. Hopefully I can do basic colors. Almost no shading. That would boost me up so much. Imagine me doing a drawing with almost no shading. What I could do is I could just do like a line over here. Everything down there could be shaded. Everything up from that line, no shade. And that could work, right? I guess, uh, honestly, we're almost done with the liner, so not too bad, not too bad. We're getting there. Just a neat collab. You say that, but there's probably a trick. Ah, I need to do... My line was too messy, so I did that fast line approach i guess and it does look good i guess i should use it more often right like that's almost there is he a good dude though that's true nails in the chat I mean, it depends on what, on what exactly, huh? That's a good question. Would you bite him? That's my actual question, huh? Mm. 
if you if you would, then that means there's sexual trust. So if not then there's reason to doubt. Let's see how saturated we can make this look too. Hopefully I can make it like super saturated and make it work. That's my wish. Them hot dog shoes. I mean. Time to take out the grippers, right? The ca caterpillar grippers, I guess. I don't even want to see him. I'm sorry. I know it's meant to say I'm sorry I'm late. But it sounds funny that... Hi, sorry I am last. <laughs> like you're the last one. The last one standing. But hi, Chubby Jesno. Welcome to the stream. And I wouldn't say it's late. We're just about to finish the first line art. As always, I'm pretty slow, so hey, it's always a good time to pop in, right? Except, I guess, when I'm about to end the stream, but that's not now, and still, it's a good time to always say hi, I guess. Yes. People listen. In your corner of Argentina be like, is that the Green Reaper? Is it? I'm sorry, I don't know Spanish at all, so I didn't realize his name had that. I mean, I think we know you do. You don't know Spanish, considering the quince being 13 instead. But we forgive you. <laughs> okay, now. Oh, I just forgot this line this other line and now now we can start erasing the sketch so that we can start painting yeah <laughs> we know <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry for being so white. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. It's so hopefully we're all in um I now feel the the ties too small. I'll fix it um soon. Oh hopefully we're all in uh 
this is a good community, good welcoming community, and there's no sins. It's all it's all about the grub love. I mean, I feel like I would fail so badly if you said like any word in French. That's like, I'm pretty sure that's my biggest language weakness. That's the one where if I pronounce anything in French, people are like, what? Why would you ever pronounce it like that? This feels wider now, so it's a lot better. But let me look at it from afar to see if it actually works. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you actually write in the um, Chinese uh, glyphs, I guess, I would not be able to tell a thing. I feel like I well, could try to guess some Japanese ones, which I'm pretty sure some would be similar to some Chinese ones, but um, I would have no idea. But I don't think it would do that bad when it comes to um I don't I don't think I would do that bad when it comes to uh Romanji Romanji which is which it is it um for Japanese I guess Sakura Blue Yeah I, my French would be the worst. Hi, Mimi. <laughs> um, love the other word. Word. Hi, guys. Hi, how are you doing? I don't say Dela whenever saying quesadilla. Do you? You do strike me as someone who would say quesadilla. <laughs> but not in a bad way. It's all with uh with love and care and appreci appreciation, right? Thank you for allowing me to live. Tell that to uh the Green Reaper, right? All right, uh, let's do some actual coloring. Let's do some flats. Like I said, I'll try to do it like really saturated. Or I guess this is actually kind of some light coloring, I guess. But let's see what is the most we can do. I say stuff wrong on purpose. I say it to get on my friend's nerves. French is so silly. How do you say sucker blue without sticking you, your whole thong out? Uh, yeah, true, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. Um, which one? There was a thing in a Pokemon game that was called. Uh, I'm pretty sure now that you would pronounce it, battle, battle Meson. But it was written like like M A I. So I thought it was like oh it's like mansion. So it's probably like 
Mason or something like that, but it was not. People made fun of me, like, why do you pronounce it like that? And I was like, wait, what? What, 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 what is going on? Uh, I was going to say something really stupid. However, I feel too white already. So I'll keep my... I don't think you should shut yourself up for something like that. Hopefully, I... I, I honestly do feel like this shouldn't be a... a a bully zone. This should be like a bully free zone. And all the bullying that goes around here should be like light, um, funny, and uh, you know, so that everyone can have fun. But yeah, don't don't feel like you need to shut up. Please, uh, go ahead. It's something that. Hopefully we can all laugh together about it and never something that you feel dumb or guilty about. And besides, I feel like dumb thoughts are always the the best ones. It's always funny. So yeah. Uh Why would you say that for me to say that uh, I'm from Spain? Argentina say sh sometimes, I think. Yeah, I think both uh, Spanish and Argentinians do have a little bit of that shushin sound. But I think it, it's not that weird of an assumption. If, like, everyone has a... Uh, Spanish-speaking country that they default to, so it's like a guess, right? If they don't know you, it's always going to be a little bit of a guess. I hope there's zero. No, but what if there's a uh, Dong Spanish fan, huh? We should all welcome the Dung Beetle Spanish fan. I would. We need we need more fans, not less. I just want to know living in Spain without the S. Okay. <laughs> Just call yourself dung. I sometimes uh stumble on my world on my words like I was saying, so yeah. In a way I did. Expand. <laughs> now, sometimes I, I stumble too much on my words. Especially when I'm, like, excited and thinking, like, a lot of things at the same time. I need to work on that, truly. Dung is a funny word. I mean, it's similar, right? Dung. Dong, 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 yeah. Bong. Just trying to say my name here. And I'm getting bullied now. See, but it's all good fun. 
I hope. I didn't know they made that sound. Bong. <laughs> what the? That's too good. She dong on my beetle until I shell. <laughs> I don't even get why. Would that be a thing? But. <laughs> uh, that's an interesting one. Made me laugh. I guess it is a thing now. It's for the records to show. It's something that has been said in the world now. That has been... That is something that now exists in our minds. And I don't even get the full meaning of it. Like, how does that work, but... It is a thing now. Word? Word? Oh, from over the garden wall. That's true. That's too over my shield comment limit. <laughs> yeah, over the garden wall was pretty good. I'm gonna continue talking to you. Hey, I don't want to hear about Duncan somewhat. No! Don't leave us because of that. I'm sorry. That's not what my my name is meant to be. It's just my name is... I'm just a... I'm just a beetle. It's not my fault that I am a dung beetle. I guess in a way it is my fault, but... You get what I mean? Cultist behavior? Why? Let's do... The line that I talked about. Mm. If this line is going across through here, probably getting probably can do it like this. Watch it in every year in October. Oh, really? It's pretty cool. It's a good little ritual to have. Over the garden wall. <laughs> it's a September beginning of fall show. That's, that might be true. Hey, Mature Radish. Hi. You've never watched it? You should. It's fun. Blocking no, no, no. Grubs, you're so combative today. Are there any mods here? I'm the mod. And I say, give them a chance. I'm the law. Why is there a wall in the garden? Well, not two before my, two days before your birthday. So it's a good watch then. 
a birthday watch. What if you are from South America and you have spring? That is true. Uh, they have flipped. Flip seasons. Climate issue. Gonna watch it with your friends. That sounds cool. Can I be the mod and just ban everyone? I wouldn't want to give that type of power if you're trying to get rid of everyone. That is not the way to use it. In my country, there's only rain and summer, but fall is just a mentality. Yeah, that's probably true, I guess. I think it should be mod because I'm the streamer pet. Is everyone just trying to be the mod now? It's autumn where, where I am right now. Mm. So maybe you should watch it right now. Now is the time to watch it. Watch it. Yeah. Please just one bit. <laughs> no, why? Open mod applications. <laughs> no, I am the mod. I am the one who mods. <laughs> Can I have mod? I'm on every stream except the stupid Spanish stream. Ignore that one. That's true. That may cost you the... The modding title. I don't want to be a mod too much power. If I'm being honest, right now I don't think there's a need for a mod. Just everyone just behave uh, nicely to each other and honestly, there should be no issues, right? My application for mod is that I'm keeping that I make AV honor roll while in honor classes. So I'm super smart and take orders. Well. <laughs> Although it is a funny topic, so I'm letting it, I'm letting it slide. But yeah, I'm not taking mod applications at the moment. Okay, hopefully this is going quickly enough. I think I'm liking this few set of colors and this line fe feels fun enough. Like we said before, it's just shading. So basically everyone would Expect my authority and respect my bedtime. I respect your bedtime. Or do you mean that I should stop streaming when you go to bed? Because I usually do go for longer. What if I became like super evil though? You mean as a mod or as a grub chatting? Evil mod arc. <laughs> then that's a reason why I wouldn't. Uh, give you the power you just uh, you're just working against yourself wanting to be a mod hi div 
Welcome to the stream where apparently everyone is fighting to be a mod. Even though I'm not giving any mod um powers at the moment. But hey. Pretty late. And I've gotta be up early tomorrow, but I wanted to pop in. I miss seeing y'all. I've been busy. Hey, I mean there's always things in life, but as long as you say hi, that's pretty fine with me. I'm glad you stopped by. So are you leaving now or are you staying for a little bit? If you need to go, then I'm glad you say hi. The guy should be a mod. <laughs> Everyone wants to be the mod. No. I am the mod. I am. That's me. I am the one with power. That's too dark, I guess. Maybe I could do... Just like this. Uh, I'll be here for a minute. That's pretty good. At least to enjoy the moment. Won't last forever. Do -do 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 -do. That's like a Parappa song, right? I haven't played the game, but it feels like something right up my alley. I like the style and the songs that I've heard right now. Uh, I think Limon is from... <laughs> Ooh! Damn. The this. I think Evil Limon would write uh, like the Portuguese does. Hostia, still. <laughs> you can't run fast. You have short legs. Probably, I think. <laughs> I'm guessing. Okay, okay. Uh, I think we need a line. Wait. Am I using this one? I think we need a... Ooh. A line over here. What? No! Not that color. All it takes is one day. All it takes is one day of being in a mod and... You go through your evil arc. Without even getting to be a mod. You, you're already there. Orange ear, orange. Maybe it's too orange, but let's test it out anyways. I kind of like it. I just, I'm just following the idea of a line like this. Even though it's not super well done. we go it's probably because of the asterisk I'm already Spanish does that mean I'm cursed according to Limon uh, that's that's the deal right I 
<laughs> you should not have said that. Now you're in danger too. There's about to be a fight. <laughs> this is the moment where you run. <laughs> you, you, you're actually having your evil art to daily mode. <laughs> Is it because of your sculpture? You couldn't get it right now. You're um taking it out on everyone. You got a feasy. Saved by the bell. Don't, don't forget to color. I'm the pencil. Are you? It's because uh, we're saving the best for last. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. I get distracted. I also need to do this little thing. But that's true. I don't rem even remember what I was doing. I think it was this. I think I got it now. I'm doing the little colored headband, I guess. I am the walrus. Cuckoo, cuckoo, Mr. City, Blissman City. Blissman, you know, uh oh. See how the. Don't remember how it goes, honestly. Oh! Wait, I had my audio unmuted. Here we go! Hey, thank you, Orion. Gotta go, but thank you. That was a great was great catching the streams here around oh no thank you for coming to the stream uh and thank you so much for the five bucks uh good night don't let the bed bugs bite and hopefully i'll see you next week too kind you're too kind uh i saw a clip of this one awful horror movie about this scientist taking people and grafting them onto walrus's bodies? Why? That doesn't sound familiar to me. But interesting. Tusk? Is that the name of the movie? Is that the name of the movie? Then please let me be mod so I can take care of the chat. No evil behavior. I'm not sure if I trust you after seeing how you behave today. Poor Leo now feels bad about being white, basically. I don't want that. Oh, this one is too blue, maybe brighter. I like this better. Ah! To me, me? Just Tusk. Never watched it, but some kids in my class talked about it. I actually. I feel it. The name sounds familiar, but I don't. Uh, Honestly, don't recognize the plot at all. No, I was just role-playing as a Spanish average person. 
That sounds to me like you're trying to not only save yourself, but trying to do some Spanish slander now. <laughs> Looks at you with my anime eyes. Sugoi. Interesting. Sugoi desu ne. Wait, what happened? I thought I had erased this. Do you think I'm Subarashi? Subarashi da Jarek School. No, I think you're Omoshiroi. Omoshiroi. What Japanese adjective am I? Oops. Uh, maybe I'll do it with a little bit of blue. <laughs> Guys, I, I can't help but laugh at that. Guys, uh, I have this guy on my Tumblr DM said role plays as a wolf and he asked me for treats. <laughs> I don't know if that's good or bad. Like I said, as long as you're okay with it, I guess. It's fine. But at the same time, I feel like with your luck, it's probably like unprompted. So I'm not sure. <laughs> like I said, as long as you're okay with it, it's fine. But it just made me laugh that it felt like out of nowhere. No more Japanese honorifics. This took a wrong turn because of me. I'm sorry. I just wanted to know mine. What does Subarashi mean? Something like wonderful, right? Or splendid or... It's a good thing, I'm pretty sure. Impressive? I don't know. Wonderful? Yeah, that's a good word. It is unprompted. <laughs> then what? Then what? <laughs> then what is going on? <laughs> I don't think that's okay then. I'd be like, wait, what? Excuse me? Are you talking to me? No, but like we said, you either need to um, block or actually put people in their places. You must have Interesting DMs. Like, I don't get any DMs. <laughs> and I, I can't imagine getting something like that. I'm so confused. So am I. So am I, Dib. But hey, I mean, what can we do, huh? Sometimes it is better not to, not to know, not to understand. This chat is going everywhere. We need to make a topic to talk about. <laughs> 
<laughs> to your little <laughs> No, no, again with the white pulling. Where Leo's gonna <laughs> is gonna feel that some uh Leo will feel discriminated against. Ah, uh, no, this this stream is one of those um, chaotic ones, but in a pretty fun way. It has been pretty funny to me. I came in, and apparently the Latinos are cursed and Japanese honorifics. Yep, El Wolf, El Lobo. I love that, um, did any of you watch, uh, what was it, um, Free Birds or something like that? It was that movie about, um, the Thanksgiving turkeys going back in time. There was this pretty funny gag about, uh, and it was something about El Solo Lobo or something like that. That one was pretty funny to me. Lobo is masculine wolf. Lobo is femme. That's true. You're learning. There we go. Those There are some points for you. Like Shakira. <laughs> El Wolfo. Free bird. That movie is... I mean, for a while, it became a meme. So, it escaped its underrated uh, status. That must be the one that I was thinking about, right? Free bird. Naked, 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 naked. Free bird. Something like that. Is it that one? Or am I making it up? Maybe I'm making it up and I don't even know. Whoa, what happened? Uh Sorry for a second, my YouTube chat died. I was like, what? Is the stream okay? Hopefully it is. Let me check. Seems like it is, but... Oh no, there's a warning right now. I'm scared now, and I don't see any movement in chat. Uh, from that. <laughs> I mean, I, I see that now, so. I guess that's something, at least. We'll be going back to the to the first Thanksgiving to get turkeys off the menu. Can someone translate that for me? We do not need to bring time traveling into this. We're going back in time to. We're going back in time to avoid the evil arcs happening today. No more evil arcs. Can you tell me how to ask for drugs?
I mean, it is different writing from speaking, so yeah, that a U could sound like an O a little bit, so I can see that. I can see the confusion. You just said drugs, drugs, laments. And why would they teach you that? Anyways. <laughs> I really love the yellow on the apple. Oh, thank you. Now you do. Actually, I should turn this more into a purplish color, but I'll do a second. Um, a second shading color, so we can actually have the two. Give me the drug fastly. Hurry it up. This ain't no game. I'm not playing. I'm about to shade another color, so oof, no light. No lighting, no, nothing like that. I need to avoid it. Because if I start, I won't stop. I know myself. But I'll do the lines. Because at least they're quick enough, right? At least they're quick enough, I think. Whoop. There's actually a little line over here from the that I didn't erase from the sketch. But ah. like this. All right. Uh, I think I'll just up for saying turn this over and over. <laughs> I literally forgot Ola, but you remember drugs. It tells us about your priorities then. Don't worry, I lost all my Korean. Didn't forget Anna. Uh, I just know the typical one they tell you to say. Uh, what is it? Something like. Something like that. And you do the little heart. They tell you, oh, say. And you and do the little. Um, finger heart, and you do the right. When I read Spanish, I cannot understand, but if you prompted me to speak or write, I would draw a blank. Yeah, it's pretty different to just read something that's there to actually. Coming up with your own words, I guess. And speaking is also something that can be a whole nother deal.
Pedro sempre antes da sogra. But yeah, that's also not encouraged chat to <laughs> consume drugs. I actually don't do any any type of drug at all. And I would never I know this sounds ironic, but I would never I have like a basically like a pact with myself that I would never do anything. No alcohol, no drugs, no nothing in my life. I don't have um you know has your maybe no finger hearts though. That's how I was thought of uh to do it, but yeah. <laughs> But yeah, no, no hard thingies. Like the the only knowledge that I have from that is basically K-pop fan friends that I have. That's why. Are we basically doing the whole uh all the ways to to ask for it? <laughs> no. Me too. The saying or the pact, I guess. Yeah, don't do drugs, kids. I feel like when I'm saying it, it sounds ironic, but it's not. I, I think it's a lot better to have fun um, without the need of anything, right? That's what I think, at least. I'm like, hey, I can fun. I I can have fun. Just, you know, being me, having fun, doing fun activities, right? No, that shouldn't be the case for you, Grubs. You can't do drugs, Grubs. Don't do drugs, Grubs. That's the new... phrase of the day. Don't do drugs, Grubs. Yeah, me too. What a lamer? No, I I support that. Because I am also no drugs and no alcohol for me. You don't you don't do <laughs> You don't drink either, uh Jadix. I think you, you don't, right? Or do you? And you don't strike me as a drug person either but I don't know maybe I honestly don't and I think it's pretty fun to I'm pretty happy all the time love my life and I have fun no I don't yeah that's right then <laughs> what are you talking about then <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Come on now. I would have, I would say I have an addictive personality, but not to substances. Me too. I'm super addicted to like games or a lot of things. Whenever I get into something, I get like super fixated on it, but never drugs. Heading out for the night. First time not lurking on a stream. Had fun. Yeah, without drugs. That's true. It's true. 
Thank you for uh, coming to the stream, Immature Radish. Hopefully I'll see you next time. I do streams every Monday, so have a good night. Don't let the bed bugs bite. See you. Stay sober, kids. Yeah. That was so corny. It's a drug. You love? Anime cherry blossoms. This, I, I did the little sound effect. But I love it. I... I could picture the whole... Anime eyes... Looking upwards... And holding hands together. Is it love? I'm one with nature. Me too. Let's go, Team Sober. Team Silver wins tonight. <sighs> Apparently, Noble means Timberwolf. Wait, what? What is a, is a timber wolf a species? They don't know about specific types of wolves, I guess. Although I do like wolves, but I, I never, I have never looked into types of wolves. Tim's wolf. Honestly, they're all basically the same to me. <laughs> but I guess people can say that about bugs too, right? Who am I to say something? That way, so I am the most little wolf boy. You can be the loba if you, if you believe in, in yourself. Just believe. In the end, all the drugs were the friends we made along the way. Also the wolves too. All the wolves were, were the friends we made along the way. Oh my god, I, what? I'm about to hit three hours. What? This was meant to be... I think I know what to do as a second doodle which would take um a lot less time uh and then at least then we can get two drawings per stream although what i don't know how i take so long to draw Though I've been having a lot of fun today. A lot of chaos going on. But hey, it's welcome, I guess.
Hmm. This actually needs to be a little bit my steel baby girl. Is it a baby girl status check? Baby girl status check of the day. Let's do the shoes. Timon has a baby girl, two wolf boys, that's true. So is my chiquita. I'm gonna do dar. Plan to get free education, then get an art degree or one in coding so I can become a tattoo artist or a video game maker. Wanna make video games someday too. Yeah. I have a few fun ideas, although I feel like coding it all would be such a pain. But it is a fun concept. Carboy. Rum rum. Good chow. My little car boy working at the car wash at the car wash. Whoa, whoa, yay, yay. The only way to find how painful coding is for you is to do it. I mean, I know basic coding, so... And I like coding, but I feel like there's some things that I wouldn't want to do. For example, I think I could code uh, basic movements, and I could do that, but... I have no idea how would I would find a way to make my game a multiplayer game, which I would like to have it as such. I feel like that would be like so I don't know, like just trying to research that I hate research. So Once my friend and I role played as cars. Really? Interesting. Which car were, were you? Whoop. I would be a beetle. <laughs> Okay, time to write upside down. What does it say? Great, great deals. Okay, so time to write upside down. Great. Almost messed that one up. Great. So was it like Transformers? Like he was a car and I had to steal the car and get away from the police? But you were the cars or were you just role-playing like you used cars in the role-play? Because that is different. People sim for the female cars in the Cars movies, okay. It's okay. I mean, yeah. Makes sense. Would be a great time to flip your canvas, you know? 
I didn't think about that, but... I think we're in too deep. And I've got it. See? Great deals. There we got it. I was a human, he was a car. Interesting dynamic. I was a human girl, he was a car boy. Hey, punk. How are you doing? Uh, sorry, I had to stretch at the same time. Uh, how's your day? Uh, pretty good. I had a fun day today. I guess, uh, getting some stuff to m build a little terrarium, I guess. And now we're drawing, although I'm drawing pretty slow, yeah. But, eh, that's the usual. How are you? How was your day today? Anything fun? That reminds me of the guy who F the car. You think she left him? Okay, this should be enough. Enough. El Grim Reaper. All right. I'll say this is also enough for this one. I think looks good. Let me just place it this way. I like it. I think it looks good. I think it looks fine. Give me a second. I'm gonna save it. And so I guess we have to do Miku as our Cyan. But I actually might skip Cyan, I guess, for now. Just in the sake of time. Or no. Okay. I'll try to do this too as the most speedrunny. In the most speed runny way that I can, maybe. Let's see. All right. This is saved. Didn't go super crazy with the color this time. You may say that, but at the same time. It's been three hours. Like, how? This wasn't such a complicated drawing. I feel like I didn't do too much shading. Yet, three hours? What? I don't know. Maybe I feel like I was super slow with the um, line art. And that may have been it. But I don't know what went wrong with it. But who knows? All right, let's see. Let's do a little research. Two hours of that was the sketch liner. Yeah, I think. Uh, I don't know why I took too long this time. <sighs> let's visualize a Hatsune Miku. I'm using all the power in my mind. To, to do it. Doesn't help that you were torn between chat antics and drawing. Yeah, it was a pretty interesting few 
uh, pretty interesting set of chat topics, maybe. Okay, I think I can do something super, super sketchy, super, super, and I'm even gonna skip this sketch, so it's gonna be that crazy. And also, let's set up a timer. Uh, wait, what? Talk, maybe? Let's set up a small timer for... I guess 15, no, 20 minutes. Let's do that. Whew. Okay. Guys, what if I said that I am crazy? <laughs> uh, oh, Limon, I'm going to bed. Goodbye. Pretty girl, goodbye. Wolf boy, goodbye, dog. Please give me mod. Um, no, but good night. Hope you had a fun time during the stream. And hopefully I'll see you next week. Good night. Don't let the bed bugs bite. I give you my Tumblr user. All right, let's do the cyan, I guess. Uh, okay, let's see how crazy we can go with it. This is speed runny levels of crazy Hatsune Miku. Just whatever style. I think YouTube blocked it. Oh yeah, if you if you type like uh, a URL. It does plug it, so you should just say like the name, I guess. keep getting worse i should i would say it's only in good fun you don't need to put yourself down leo don't ever think that not knowing another language is uh, something that to feel ashamed of it's it's okay hopefully it's all in good fun Yeah, you should see if you want. Looks like a giant gorilla arm. Uh, like that. What's it called? Uh, I don't remember that skull girl's girl that had big giant arms on her head. I got a head, but I'll see you around. Don't worry, uh, thank you for coming to the stream, and you actually uh, stood a lot longer than I expected, but it was pretty fun. Thank you for coming to the stream. Good night. Don't let the better bugs bite. See ya. It won't. I think it's fine. Let's not make it a recurrent joke. It's nothing bad, actually. 
Just something fun that popped out. And, uh... It's fine being Spanish, right? All right, we're 15 minutes in or uh, does that mean, wait, I don't know if that, this clock is not moving at all. I don't even know now. I'll just draw, I guess. This clock doesn't help me. It doesn't say anything. Just drawing super, super fast. The fastest make me cool into a girl twink. I'm not sure how that works, but maybe Well, broken clock is right twice a day, so just wait 12 hours. Yeah. That's me with my alarms. I'm like, well, I missed it. Might as well just wait another, a whole another day, right? Not even 12 hours, just the whole 24 hours. Yeah, just draw for 12 hours. I should do like a little marathon one day. It would be like super crazy for me and we would need to have like some in-between activities or something. But it would kind of go hard, right? Oops. Trying to do a little bit of a diamond shape here for the leg. Uh, that's what I think, girl. That looks like an androgynous boy. Does it? Maybe that makes sense. No fudge. Put in the like the birch, which is manly in some way. But I think a girl twink would be lean. I believe too lean. I'm kind of doing her like too lean. But I'm not sure. I'm just. Trying to make this pretty fast, but that also works. Miku is kind of built like that. Read the UK manga and finally two hundred chapters in. That's pretty cool. How has it been? I need to get back into reading manga. I'm, I like, I miss it.
I should need to make this one shorter so that I can uh, I can show a little bit of the body, not cover it, it all up like this. Now we can move this around a little bit like this. Also, manga is certainly something. I can't spoil anything, but wow, just wow. I I did buy a few chapters like physically, so honestly, if it's good, I could start it in a few days. I feel like I just read the first chapter or something like that. Like I said, I've been slacking on how much I've been reading. What 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 How does this would this work? Like this Yeah, no spoilers for that one, but if it's good it sounds nice. Sorry, I bumped the mic. Okay, I have nine minutes left. Trying to do one of those funny light thingies. Uh, is it okay if I mention someone's ability? Wait, wait, wait. I read part of the interview. Well, the character's hard to explain. Uh, yeah, I think it's fine. Whenever I read it, I'm probably gonna forget up until the moment that I find that character and I'm like, oh. Maybe this is it, but it sounds like one of those spoilers that I would forget. So yeah, go ahead. Now this looks like a police baton or something. Uh, for me, the hardest ability to understand was this gambling ability, but it could have been also this judgment constellation ability. Going with the gambling, because I still don't follow. It 
that's the constellation one. I see. I feel like I don't understand either reference, but I will someday. I will. And woof, we're f five minutes. We have five minutes left. I should do the other ones like this too. Just time challenge. So that we don't take as long. But I think uh, last time I said my goal was to do three drawings this stream and then the next one do three again. And I think we can make that happen. So it's not the end of the world. So, in a way, we're on schedule. We're touching base, but let's not get into that for that sake. I guess, I guess that starts uh, getting into a uh, spoilerish territory. Yeah, that might be the case. Because then I might have to speculate and wonder. Ooh. Where's the other pigtail going? Hmm. Trying to think. Where would the other one go? I like it over here. Guys, I'm trying so hard to spell a word, but I can't. Is it can't? Is can't the word? <laughs> like physics, but it's not. Ha but it doesn't have to do with gravity and stuff like are you trying to find the word or what is it that you're struggling with Okay, we're almost there, about to be two minutes, um, two minutes for the thingy to, to tell us we're done, but it starts with P, but then when I search her up, I get tarot readings. Uh, it's like physics, but it's not, it doesn't have to do with gravity and stuff. I'm trying to think, because I, I feel like I would know something like that. Doesn't it? Any more clues? Looking at tarot cards right now. 
I have no clue what you're talking about still. Yeah, I'm wondering too. What? Do I have it spelled right? Oh! So, physics, and you're thinking about psychics, right? Psychics is PSI. Is Y and uh, physics is with that H, so I think you said it right then. You got it. Okay, I think this works. Let's uh, do a little movie magic. And boop, ta da, ta da. Now, we color everything. Oh, wait, this one not. And uh, da -da 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 -da. let's do 15 minutes for the coloring. Let's do. Actually, I want this to be like a very soft color, but we can do greener. Softer. With more saturation let's do wait looks like this it should be up until here up until here bucket tool for this, for this, for this, for this, for this. Uh, I'm getting tired, but hey, so almost less than till one. Maybe I can go till one thirty. Might be your uh, the day that you stayed up until really, really late, right? The most, the uh, the most late that you've been up until. Uh, give me like this color. Yeah, and I'm trying to finish this quickly too, so hopefully we can get this all done pretty soon. But I'm, I wonder if I had to, I think I might have to leave the other, the blue drawing for the next time. And I'll do that thing where I do, you know, timers. Next time. But I'll see, I'll see. Color her stick pink. Let's do that. Wait, needs to be a little bit brighter like this. And then we do inside like this and we can actually give this outline a color to make it feel even brighter like this There we go. 
and maybe like this. I guess it should be a little bit brighter. Oh, there's an issue because the post looks very Toho. I like it. Oh, you think so? I wonder if I subconsciously drew inspiration from that because now that i look at it it does kind of feel that way <laughs> but that's a fun way to look at it Isn't Toho that rhythm game? Uh, it's more like a shoot 'em up game. But it does have, it is known for its songs, so. Yeah, it's like a bullet hell. It is like super well known for the songs that it has, so. Kind of makes sense. You might be thinking of Taiko no Tatsujin. Is that the drum one? That's like the drumming game. Also, Me Dream has me transforming into a cat, living as a cat in cat territory, having to compete, complete tasks. I don't think I've had a dream where I'm not my normal me but i'm not sure maybe i had a dream where i'm not controlling myself so maybe that counts like bullet hells those are fun like dying yeah i like bullet hells too Uh, I want to have this color, but I like this, I think. Oh, I'll do this. I know what I'll do. I'll do this. And then I want to color the outline too with a fun color like this let's see ah if this works i can't remember any but i know undertale delta rune yeah they do have like um bullet hell type of segments when you fight right basically megalovania is that right yeah, they have those elements in combat. You know what the one that I love that I feel like not many people um, think about it as much? Uh, Geometry Wars. That one is just so good. Sadly... Uh, the second one, which is my favorite, is an on Steam. My dreams are weird. I, I be playing characters sometimes, like a long. 
with being a cat. I was also playing a character that was based off loose from the outhouse. Oh, what what I have done is that I've dreamt about being inside of a video game. But I'm usually still me controlling I feel or, or as that's what I remember right now. I'm not sure. I'd have to think about it. I don't even know what type of eyes I would do for this. This needs to be like gray, I guess. And let's do a fun green, I guess. Let's do also for this. Also started playing Seiko. I'm not sure if I heard of that one. Cover looks cool. Yeah, I recently played um some of Mushiki Mesama again. But I'm not sure how many um bullet hells I've played aside from From Toho, that's the one that I played the most, I guess. Yeah, it's always a fun thing to to explore. The thing is that it's usually like really hard, so. But uh, I mean, that's fun. Uh. Give her those square eyes with only the top lid and no eye whites. Give her those square eyes with only the top lid. Like very anime-esque. Like... Uh, you mean like this and then we do like a little highlight? That works. Or does the highlight go over here? Like this? Oops. I think I'll leave it like that. Uh, Zeho is an offshoot Toho. Done by a different dev, but the music is just Toho dev. Oh, I see. I did see a few screenshots that felt like super Toho-like. You would call me a normie, Chad. I mean, Jadix is like, knows like all the super niche things. Yeah, so I don't think that's many times I don't even know what it is. And, I, and I'm, I wouldn't say I'm like super, super knowledgeable in all things, but I do know quite a few things and even then there's some reference that I don't get oh 
One minute left. Okay. Uh, I'm probably gonna go to sleep. People are gonna be working on our roof, and I want to get snuff leaf before then. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, thank you for coming to the stream. It was fun. Hopefully, you had fun. Have a good night. Don't let the bed bugs bite. See you next time, Leo. Okay, time is almost up. But we're doing some crazy lighting thing going on here. Good night, Jackson Dog. Jackson Dog. Thanks for listening. <laughs> Did we go crazy? Yeah, no problem. It was always fun. I hope you always feel that it's all in good fun. Remember to love your nose because it's yours and. Yeah, have a good night. Okay, time is up for this. But, wait, what? This, there's a mistake over here. This should be this, I guess. Maybe it was the hair, but it got mixed up. So... Now it's the dress, I guess, the skirt. Whoop. All right, like this. And da -da 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 -da. I think this one classifies more as a fun doodle, hopefully. And we were faster, although it took us basically around 40 minutes. So still not fast enough, although much faster. But yeah, I'm a little bit disappointed on how long it took me to draw this this during this stream I don't know what happened but it happened now this is it although I I like this uh, wow all right I think I think it's pretty late I think I'll leave it here this time and we're almost about to hit four hours. I think if next time we set up a timer, we can do the remaining four, right? I think it would be better than to strain myself after this. Or I could do a fast Sonic. Would be fitting. Despite all the angles, it still look just around this. Like you like. Yeah. I thought I... I mean... That's a way that I can work when it comes to doing something quickly. It's not perfect, but it's like a little doodle. It was basically no sketch. But yeah. I think we're going to leave it here this time. We're going to do that. Next time, I'll set up a timer. Uh, if you're here, Jadix, you need to remind me uh, before I start doing things. But we, we'll set up a timer. We'll do... Wait, why is there a... Basically a blank space over here. We'll set up a timer. We'll do... Um, quicker doodles. And we'll finish up the wheel. Of colors. But yeah. Thank you Grubs for coming to the stream. It was 
actually a really fun one. And I hope you had fun too. So yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll see you next time, grubs. Thank you for coming to the stream. Bye-bye.